Hello everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and welcome back to some more Pixelmon Let's Go with me, and, um, I can explain all this. There's a very good, reasonable explanation, which I happen to already have pre-recorded, and I'm going to show the clip for right about now. Hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Pixelmon from the Pixelmon Let's Go server. Today, I'm joined by Ginger Shadow, da, da, and da. it's very ominous. Show show me show me what you got, Ginger. That thing. Oh, oh you're actually holding it. it Look kind of like a piece of bread from my. Yeah, you can't really view. see it th this angle, but yeah. <laughs> okay, so for me, like this isn't like the start going to be start of any of my videos, but like just throw I'll throw it in the middle somewhere where I need to explain a thing. So basically, this thing apparently is really valuable. I got this quite soon after I joined the server. It's for a ho ho. I I like ho ho. He's a beautiful bird, but. Uh, Realistically, I like a lot of other legendaries more. So, basically, people started offering me things, but then one madman decided, hey, I'll offer you literally my kidney for it. So, you know. Well, here I am, like said half madman. a kidney. You were literally offering me pretty much a life like the other day. <laughs> <laughs> you wanted this it's thing more than anyone bell. else by quite it's a bit. It's a clear bell. I, I, I'm really not looking forward to looking for these things. So, I'm really excited about the idea of Jinji wanting to trade it with me. Yeah. So. What am I going to trade it for with Genji? Well, so, we're going to start out with this. Oh, yeah. All right, so basically, a lot of offer things were thrown around. And I asked people, like, what should I trade it for? And, yeah, I think mostly people just said get lots of legendaries. Or just get the whole for yourself and then trade it. But it's like, nah, I'll just let them have the bell. Because the bell itself is still a challenge in itself. And I can always try and get one later. Or if I win, like, a tournament or something, maybe I could get one. So... I'll take that chance over, like, trying to use this one right now. Because I feel like I need this stuff more. So, right. Stuff you offered for the beginning was you offered a Spear Master Ball. Which, coincidentally, I actually got one earlier today. So, it's not as brilliant a moment as it would have been. Because it's now my second instead of my first. But, it's a Master Ball. I'm never going to say no to a Master Ball. As one shouldn't. Yeah. Now, once upon a time, you're also offering 2.1 million Poké Dollars. But, since then, I got information about how to get lots of pokey dollars so i don't really kind of threw in my own glasses with that and uh i mean i didn't realize how powerful it was like it's just me doing lots of grinding i just use my persian and <laughs> now i've got like half a million pokey dollars and i don't have to like worry about money anymore so uh, i told them about the poke dollar trick with the persian that uh, federan told me about back in the day and uh well i kind of like messed myself up yeah. there because so no, fair, I didn't it didn't, want to it didn't start off really anymore. good like, it started off pretty bad because Persian was only at level 20 or something. And he just had payday. So it started off quite slow. And I was, like, looking at it, I'm like, eh, it's okay. But I just, as I kept going, because I do a lot of grinding. So it built up over time, pretty much. Now I've got, like, yep. a small fortune. So I don't necessarily need money. But, I mean, that seems, it's probably better for you you told me that. Because then you didn't have to, like, grind 2.1 million Poké Dollars to pay to me in installments. So yeah, it's probably better I'd just like... trading a couple of items rather than, you know, having to go do that. Yeah, probably. I would think probably. anyway. All anyway, right. the things that we're going to trade is the rest of the Pokemon. So we have seven legendaries that I have doubles off or multiples off because Ta -ta. of whatever I did. Okay, and so a spare Ditto and Rotom. That was the thing so as well. So okay, originally when it came to legendaries, the one the I say the main thing I'm mainly after, aside from the likes of like say Mewtwo, Palkia, Dialga and stuff, because though they have event things. So I want to do that by myself. They are cool events. I want to see them. I want to try them. So ignoring all the event ones. The main ones I'd say were probably like the likes of Deoxys, Jirachi, and Darkrai. But those are a lot harder to get, so, you know. Honestly, if I was asking I for them, I'd those. probably just be able to ask for maybe them by themselves. And not much else, because it, I'd be asking for quite a big thing at that point. It'd be like a legendary for a legendary. But alternatively, yeah, you've got a lot of extra legendaries, a lot of spares, a lot of things that might take me a long time to go catch. So. I'll just trade a ho ho to you for, you know, a bunch of extra legendaries that will save me time later. Plus, there's some cool yeah, ones yeah. in there. Yeah, and most of them have the correct nature, too. I know nothing about it. Are natures. you ready? Do you have like. Yeah, I'm ready. Uh... I've got like a bunch of extra little mons just sitting here. Okay. As I'll toss well, some of these your way. to be garbage, but garbage and iced. Aww. Okay, so. Oh, wait, we didn't... There we go. So I don't actually think we told anyone exactly what we're trading, but okay. So. No. Trade number one. A Rayquaza. Now, uh, Rayquaza, I have a bit of a thing with because literally I uh, I almost had one and then literally it just sort of disappeared and it was really sad. 
So, might as well get one out and save me some time. Now, Tapu, I just asked if there's any Tapus on sale. Like, I think Tapu Coco is probably the favorite just because it's, you know, from Pokemon Sun and Moon. If you're going to look at any it's Tapu Coco. It's also one of the most difficult ones. Yeah, Tapu Coco <laughs> is probably like the, like the coolest one because it gets the coolest moments and thingy. Plus, it's electric and it's, it's designed to look really cool. But any of the Tapus is nice. So, is that? Yeah. Tapu Lele is probably like my second favorite, maybe. So, is that next up? Tapu Lele and Tapu Bulu are the easiest to get because they spawn during day and night. Okay. Where Tapu Coco is dawn and Tapu Fini is ah, dust. Ah, so really small or the windows. Other way around. Yeah, it's really small windows. All right, so next up we get the and Zernius. Tapu Fini is even near water, so. No, this is this a Zernius. is a This is Veltal. There we go. So this is just a kill thing. Um, I figured it'd probably be quite a pain to get. So you know, and I've got I've got its partner technically. So you know, may as well. This thing I don't fancy fishing in the ocean. A lot. I don't really care for Manaphy that much. I mean, I've watched the Manaphy movie, so that was nice. But, you know, it's it's still a Manaphy, and it still it saves me dipping in the ocean for it. The hell is that thing? It's the Meloetta. Meloetta. Another... Oh, this... Oh, there we go. Meloetta. I think this thing actually spawned near me once upon a time, but I couldn't find it. I couldn't catch it. That was a thing once. It's not always the easiest thing to find, no. I've definitely seen at least one spawn in the server. Or one spawn near me somewhere, but it was like really near the start, so I couldn't get it. All right, Rotom. I just I just fancy a Rotom because well they're cool, and I I they they spawn in like what the the dark forest, but like they're a pain to find. So. Yeah. Uh, swamplands, but I got mine oh, from Zitos, and I got one from Nebris back in the day. So okay, just breeding and, and doing that instead. Well, I figured so I'm, I'm as well asking for one since people are like I've already got one. They were just breeding them. Because, yeah, it's not a legend or anything, but, I mean, this ROM's still cool. It's got its different forms and stuff, so, nice. It's it's pretty cool. I like it. All right. And from there... Okay, so I already have one deal on my own. I have two deals, technically, but one of them is a borrowed for just a tournament thing, which I'm going to have to give back. So, getting one extra means I can now play around with deals and, like, break each other together, which should be fun. Where's that? Okay, and then you, you just said you had an extra restaurant. I don't really care for the black and white ones, but, like... They're there, so I'm not gonna say no to them. I mean, it was either them or Keldeo, and I know which one I prefer. <laughs> and yeah, it's not Keldeo, as it turns out. Keldeo's a bit of a. He's there, I suppose. Something against Keldeo, alright? I just. Uh, I'm just not a fan. I'm just not a fan. That's okay. Right. So with that, then, yeah, that's. I think that's, that's it, isn't it? That is that the entire it. thing. So yeah, in total, then. For the clear bill, I'm getting myself a Rayquaza, which can turn to Mega Rayquaza, Reshiram and Zekrom, uh, Ueltal, uh, Tapu Lele, Manaphy, Meloetta, an extra deal so I can now breed them, which saves me time hunting for another one because I found one, ever, and that's been it, and a Rotom just because I like Rotom. So, I mean, let us know in the comments what you think and, about that and, kind of trade. Oh yeah, and the Master Ball, of Ball. course. No, don't forget the Master Ball. <laughs> ah, it's just because I got that other one earlier today. I would be more excited. See if I hang that one earlier today, I would be way more excited about this. But it's just, I got one already, so it's just. I've uh, got another that one now. Been amazing. I was kind of aiming for that, honestly, but. Oh. Nah. If it was a day earlier, it would have been that, but yeah. Okay, we've also got Master Ball, which is just an our guaranteed legendary in the future. So that's cool. But yeah, let us in the comments what you think of that trade, I guess. Is it worth a ho ho? I think, I think it's worth a ho ho in terms of like saving me time and stuff, so. You get space to your inventory before like I toss this and it just sits to your feet. Yeah, no, it's, it's the right blah. there. The trade is complete. Okay, so basically, yeah, if it's assuming that clip went in as planned and everything went to went to plans. Yeah, basically I traded the clear bell off and got a lot of legendaries for it. I also got a master bow. I also went off and bought a blue orb at the shop for ten grand because yeah, I discovered the blue orb's like actually really hard to get, so I don't I don't fancy going and getting that normally. I think I'll just buy one for ten grand. But right, so um Da 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 da. Basically, for the clear bell, is a is a an insane deal. Where well, it depends how you look at it. There's two ways of looking at this. It's an insane deal because I got seven legendaries for it. I got a ditto, which is quite rare, and I got a road time just because I fancied one, and a master ball, meaning that's another legendary in the bag somewhere, or it's some random Pokemon I accidentally clicked the ball on. One of the two. So um, that's a thing. Huzzah! And you know, from I've got Mega Aquatics, I've got Zekram, I've got Yovant. Yveltal? I can already remember how to pronounce this thing. Got Reshiram, got Tapu Lele, 
Genesect I actually caught right before the doubles tournament, so he's not he's not actually part of the deal thing. No, 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 the rest of the ones, so let's just return everyone. <laughs> let's just get everyone back in the ball. They're a bit massive. You know, Tapu Lily can just stay up and back. Right, anyway, um, alright, the other ones I got were also Manaphy and uh, Melea. So, yeah, two little uh, mythical Pokemon, which is nice. Do -do -do. Manaphy! Manaphy had its own little movie and that was nice, but I've never really bothered with it. Mel, I for generally forgot existed, so. <laughs> yeah. I wasn't too, too bothered about some of these ones. But, uh, like, so get you make the likes of Mega Rayquaza is obviously insane. Your is pretty cool. Uh, Tapu, the Tapus are all cool in their own way. Even the Bill 1, I suppose. So, um, hey, I got all that just for one wee bell. And that one wee bell will produce a whole hole, which, I mean, it's a whole hole, I guess. It. It's, it's a big deal. And potentially, maybe I would have been better keeping the bell. But, realistically, getting seven legendaries, I'm not going to complain. Plus, I feel, like, a bit more justified taking, like, so much for the bell. Because, literally, these were all spares for uh, the, the chappy that I traded with. Which, it was Sten, wasn't it? I'm not misremembering names, am I? I actually need to double check. Because, yeah, I, I'm still trying to remember who's who. Yeah, it was Sten. Yeah, it was. Da, 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 I didn't misremember. I'm still worried that I'm misremembering who's who when it comes to, like, voices and it comes to exchanges and stuff. Oh, blah, blah. I'll learn eventually, but it's just getting there. But anyway, um, blah, blah, blah. So, 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 so. First things, we're just going to quickly grab some eggs because we're still egging Pokemon and all that jazz and blah, blah, blah. Oh, yeah, by the way, that second deal over there, this is Timid. Timid doesn't belong to me. Timid belongs to Will Snipe, which I should probably go give back to him now that we're done the tournament. Speaking of which, so why is it you're getting an episode normal and you're not getting an episode in the tournament? Uh, basically, the tournament was a bit of a flop for half of his. Or, well, for some of his, anyway. But some of it worked out a bit more than the rest. But basically, what happened was, there's, like, four or five people that are opt in this server and or could do the command to initiate a double battle. Because double battles, you can't just do in picks one. You've got to use commands to get it. So, uh, basically, none of them were about. It was supposed to be set up so people, like, someone would have the ability to do it. No one did. In, like, the likes of, say, Vintage Beef, who would have had the ability, I uh, pulled out the tournament because of being busy and stuff. So... Basically, no one was there to do the doubles command, meaning we couldn't do double battles. So, we had two options at that point. Either we re, uh, we re, uh, blah, what's the word I'm looking for? Reschedule, that's the one. We either we reschedule the tournament, which probably would have been the more smart thing to do. Or, we do a different set where basically one person of each team does the battle, but both people have input in the battle, aka they'll be like in the call together. So we went for that, which, uh, basically it works out for the person battling, because they obviously have the footage of the battle, but Will Snipe was the one that got to battle first. If we don't proceed and win a battle, then we're not getting in our battle. So basically, we lost the first round. Spoiler if you've not watched it on anyone else's side. But yeah, now we lose the first round, and it was a good battle, mind you. There were some mistakes made, and I did try to, like, I'm not the big, I'm not a big, a big expert, but even I, like, made some of the calls that were, like, Hey, maybe you shouldn't do that because we were at a really bad place with that. Basically, we had we had a Greninja against two Pokemon that had electric moves. And I'm like, that's a terrible idea. <laughs> but I also decided to try it. He decided to experiment with the move map block, which I kind of... Uh, it's whatever. But it stuff happened the way it did. And, you know, obviously, we're not, neither, no one's perfect in that. Battles happen. RNG's a thing. Bed to bed. I still think the one most crazy move is still, yeah, leaving that bloody... Hello, hello. Uh, leaving my um, Ash Greninja out against two Pokemon that had Discharge was insane, but... Whatever, it happened. I just looked at it, I just thought, oh my god, Ash Greninja just did nothing for this battle. But, blah, blah, blah. but yeah, basically, through it all though, because the spectating thing is broke, I couldn't really watch the battle. I couldn't really follow the battle or give, like, good advice for it because I couldn't tell what the feck was going on, <laughs> to put it simply. I, I couldn't tell what was going on majority of the time. Because it didn't, it doesn't show me anyone's health, it doesn't show me any statuses. It tells me the moves that are going on, but even I've got to try and follow it and then try and keep track of what's happening where. Plus, the moves go by really quickly in the little bar thing, so it's really hard to tell without a proper view of the fight, so... Oh! Basically, my footage is trash. And it, it would be ra I honestly think it would be rather boring, people watching it from my side. So I think I'm just not going to bother putting up the doubles thing, because the doubles... I didn't really get to partake in the doubles tournament. I got to give my mods to Wilson Knight, and he got to have a... A goal. That was it. So, yeah, I mean, go check out other people's sides of it. Other people obviously got good things from it. It's just my my stuff coming out of it. I didn't really have much to show for it. So, I just I just decided, yeah, it's not worth showing off. Then is it? I'd, I'd rather just like ignore. I like, just leave it and just watch it somewhere else than me uh, give my view, which is not a very good view. So, yeah. Also, what the hell did I get there? A beginium Z. Oh, beginium, beginium. Oh, I was beginium Z. Okay. Blah, blah, blah. Sorry about that was there for a second. Ah, blah, blah, blah. I got that one. I do not. Ooh. 
Getting quite a collection up here. Also, I have a Tapu Umzi. There's a thought for later, I suppose. We could possibly, you know, use that with our Tapu uh, Bulu. Wait, is it Bulu we've got? No, it's Lele. It's Tapu Lele, which is, yeah, the psychic uh, fairy one, which is, yeah, good. I like Tapu Lele. Probably my second favorite of the Tapus after Tapu Coco. So, yeah. Timid Nature, which is good. Right, okay. Let's put some stuff away, though. So, currently, right now, I'm like trying to breed. Uh, oh, yeah, but I'm still. I'm preparing for the draft tournament next. Like, that will obviously come out a lot better because it's single battles and stuff. I can actually record that properly. I'm, I am a bit bummed about how the tournament went down, but it's just one of those things, you know? Is People aren't around to make it work. Double is double battles are a bit more complex and stuff. Ugh. At least a bad taste about the idea that I went there to try and record it though, and it does like nothing game of it. But oh well, it's still a, it was still a fun time. It was still a fun time, so it's not all bad, you know. It is what it is. But right, okay. So um, uh, you're okay. You're just random magnemite. Oh no, no, right. Okay, currently right now, I'm trying to breed a magnemite that has a uh, magnet pill and a modest nature. What am I trying to breed? Is it you? Yeah, Modest Nature. So I'm looking for Modest Nature, but I'm looking for Magnet Pill Ability. That's what I'm currently after. I've not managed to do that. I bred many a Magnemite and not managed that. So that's my current thing. That's the last mod I need. So I've got all, all the mods for um, the thingy tournament. The draft tournament. Although I'll probably like redo Shuckle and stuff as time goes. Oh yeah, I also got, yeah, I've got Royal Ormond stuff. Let's let's check out some of these mods and actually have a little play with them, eh? But, but uh, let's show some mods off and all that jazz. So yeah, put, bring you out. Put you away, put you away. Bring, where's Rotom? Bah, there he is. Also, I've got the Ditto here. Okay, so I want to do this. I want to have my two do those breeding. Oh, yeah, I also got a shiny. Oh, I got two shinies, actually. I forgot to show off. Uh, I got two shinies off camera. Boop, boop. Got a shiny. It was a Nether Ring originally, but it leveled up to Nether I got a shiny Zubat, which, yeah, funny. Uh, Zubat's actually one of the few random shinies I actually encountered in the regular Pokemon games. Like, I think he was one I caught in Pokemon Ruby once upon a time. Or something like that. Is he a Ruby or Fire Red? It was in Gen 3 anyway. I got a shiny Zubat. I didn't really realize it was a shiny though straight away. Like, I know it's something that was awful about it, but I just, I didn't, it didn't even click to me. <laughs> it was shiny straight away. I just, ah, uh, it was back at a time where I didn't really register shinies as shinies. Like, because I, I, I wasn't on the internet and stuff back then really. So, I pretty much just went by, you know, what I did and what I saw. And no one ever really showed me shinies. So... I just saw shinies and thought that looks something irregular just happened there because I saw obviously the sparkle effect. I catch them on, not really thinking about it. Then I, I wouldn't like do anything with it. I wouldn't show off. Wouldn't really do much with it. it was... So a bit later I discovered, oh wait, it's a shiny. It's actually super rare. But yeah, but oh. Anyway, put this away. Oh, I play with Rotom for a second. Yeah, I've just got a Rotom sitting there. Oh, so right. Okay, Rotom. So you can do things, can't you? How do you work? I'm guessing. Electric, can you bugger off, please? Like, hello, sir. No, 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 go away. Jesus Christ. Right, no, actually, just kill it. Just just kill it. Just get it out of here. It's in the way. Bloody hell. Right, how do you work? I don't know. Um. Oh, okay, so you throw, okay, throw the Pokemon at the item, and it'll, oh, okay, this is interesting. So I can like get relief storm. Wait, what? He's not. Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, so now yeah, I've got rotom. That one. I think yeah, the other one I've got is rotom wash. I've got wash available. Oh, he's transform kill. Ugh. But where's the option to learn hydro pump and stuff? Oh, interesting. Oh, wait, maybe he did. Did it replace Leaf Storm and Hydro Pump? Oh, it does. Okay, cool. Oh, all right, that's how it works. Interesting. Okay, that makes sense. All right, well, yeah, I didn't I didn't fancy my chances to, like, try and catch it up, so that's thing. Like... Oh, another thing I've been up to. I've done a lot of stuff off camera, because like, I've just been, I've been working, I've been training, I've been doing all bits and pieces. I've got a Persian now. All right, we're going to put Rayquaza away. I know it's a mega Rayquaza, but we'll just put it away for now. I got Persian now. Persian's quite an interesting boy. As it turns out, Persian's actually a really, really, really good way to get rich. Because, uh, basically, people were telling me about using the likes of Payday, Happy Hour, and an Amulet coin together. 
Uh, do that with a Persian and stuff. I mean, it started off not very looking very good, but it builds up, and as Persian levels up, the money gets higher. And basically, yeah, I'll just quickly. I mean, obviously, I, I think I show I showed this in my last was it video or stream? It's one of two. I showed I showed off starting it, didn't I? So yeah, it builds up basically is what I've discovered. So happier plus damage coin, and now at level eighty-seven, I do payday. But but uh. A thousand seven hundred and forty Poké dollars off one battle. That's for one payday. If I use another payday, it will double. Currently, I have six hundred thousand Poké dollars. <laughs> I'm loaded, basically. I can afford all the things. Huzzah! So that's bloody good. So yeah, I've not got any problem getting TMs and stuff at long last. It's oh, it feels good not having to stress over it. Plus, it also means I can go into the Poké store here, and like currently, I've got four Ultra Balls. I could take the time to go and get Ultra Balls. Oh, there's no Ultra Balls on sale. You son of a bitch. <laughs> They're not even here. Oh, god damn it! You're rotating through stock. Oh, the bar. Submission or our safe. You had ultra balls yesterday. I saw them. Now you've got none. You still are. Oh, what's a pain? What's a pain? All right, whatever. Right, let me quickly grab me birdie. But yeah, so basically we've upgraded now to rich boy, I suppose. Oh, oh yeah. So there's our team as well, by the way. All right, right. I trained four Pokemon for the tournament. Wait, where's the other one? What was the other one? Oh, oh yeah, it was Ash Greninja. All right, so yeah, there's Ash Greninja here, which I still have a Warriors eating it back as well. Uh, I trained up a Togekiss, which I'm going to take the leftovers off now because he doesn't need that. Oh. So I trained up a Togekiss for this. That was fun. Uh, I got a Gyarados, which I actually like this Gyarados because it's a perfect Gyarados for one thing. But also, I made that zombie Gyarados because of course I did. The option was there and I thought, oh, this would be cool. But unfortunately, Gyarados didn't get to see all day. I trained them up and I made this at the last minute to switch. And we switched them for... Our boy here, Crocodile, who's assault vested, and he's not great because literally, I mean, uh, he didn't get to do as much in the battle as we would have liked. But also, um, I just didn't get to teach him the moves I wanted. Super Power I never got until after the tournament was done, and I was wanting to teach him knockoff over foul play. But I couldn't find tutors to teach us it, so that was... Ugh. Bloody move tutors. I spent a good, like, 10 hours on this Pokemon server trying to find things like move tutors. Oh my god. Look, I could not find any for the life of me. Right, let's put Rotom away. I'm probably going to train up Rotom uh, later on because Rotom's awesome. I love Rotom. So, bo. I've got our things. I've got eggs to hatch. Where are my eggs? I've gone past them, haven't I? Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. There they are. Okay, so I don't know what's what. So, okay, there's another project I've been working. The Vivians. <laughs> the Vivians. I still can't get one. I've got, I've got them in the right nature now. I just need them to, to learn not shield dust. I need them to learn... Compound eyes when they evolve. They don't. They don't want to learn that. They want to keep learning another thing. So basically, yeah, I now have this many of <laughs> Of various patterns as well. Like, lovely patterns I've gotten. Because I've managed to, like, just randomly evolve them in different biomes. But, all right, at this point, yeah, I've got... I got a Pokeball pattern at one point. Because I went and evolved one in the other. I've got... Whatever that one is. That might have been the mountains. Get this one, which is the one for the savannah. Get this one, which is... I forget where that one was. That was somewhere. I think it might have been the swamp, actually. I think this one was the swamp, too. I forget. Here, I've got a small army of Avions back gathering. And li yeah. Jesus. All of them. Every single one has shield dust ability. It's disgusting, really. <laughs> looks so bad that it comes. I, like, I had to start with Scarabag. I had to evolve them each one, each time. It's it's horrible, really. Oh. But, oh, well. Tease with the tears. Yeah, talent play in Persian have just been getting tons and tons of experiences from being in the party because, yeah, Hatchy has just been an ongoing thing for me. Right, I should probably say to Will tonight, hey, you want me to give you back my th the things that's yours so I can, like, return them? Because as much as I would love to hang on to, like, a timid ditto, I probably should give it up, shouldn't I? Oh, wait, what's the, what's the ditto I got, actually? There's a thought. What's the ditto that I got? Yeah, so your nature... Yeah, you're not just set anyway, so it doesn't even matter that I've got the timid deal. As long as I've just got a deal, it works. See, so yeah, I don't actually need timid anymore. I'm not sure you anyway. Ah, uh, it's okay, it's that one. Okay, uh, generally it's whatever. Right, take you off, timid. Put you there. Blah, blah, blah. All right, I'm gonna quickly, I'll, I'll message, I'll send return all the things to him, because right off of him, I technically borrowed the deal, so I could breed. I think it was so I could get impish Tokipi, but then in return, I also uh, was to give him back. One impish Tokipi. So I've got like a Tokipi bread for him there. Um, which is... Yeah, here. So this one's to go to him. Oh, yeah. Serene, yeah, Serene Grace, uh, Timid Tokipi. That was it. 
And I also have the Water Yum Z to give him back because I borrowed it for Greninja. Never got to get used properly. Greninja did very, very little. Did not get to do his part. Was, I... Ah! Right then, never mind. We're not doing that now. <laughs> Rachel plans it in dog, so I put that away. Hang on to that. I've got no space in my back. If I get, can I take something out of here? Something I can move. Take that out. Put that in. What else? Take take that out. Put that in. I so I want to save all my battle items in like a safe spot. Also put those away as well. There we go. Nice. And we'll just dump all this in here. We can work on that later. Oh. Oh yeah, I also discovered the matchup races aren't the best things to use for EV training. Matchup races are cool because they'll give you like double EVs, which with Poker Race means it'll be four times EVs. Uh, these things give you eight times, as it turns out. So, yeah, I've discovered EV training is way easier when I just decide to use the bands. So I'm really, really thankful that I was told about that and did that because otherwise EV training all the mods for that tournament would have been a pain. But yeah, so I still need to work on though certain other mods uh, for... The draft tournament. So yeah, I've got pretty much my team built for that. I also caught a Halutra, a Jolly Halutra, which I'm going to probably work on too. Because Halutra is brilliant. It's probably one of my favorite fighting Pokemon. But yeah, all right. So Donald Fang is pretty much ready. Although I want to teach him Ice Shard. Haven't found that yet. Um, Lucario is currently fainted. Hello. Lucario is currently fainted, but I've teached him, I think, the moveset I kind of want from. He's got Sword Dance, Extreme Speed, Close Combat, and Bullet Punch. Uh, we've got my Arcanine, which I just, after the tournament, managed to get the thing for a wild charge for him. So, Morning Sun, Extreme Speed, watch thing. Yeah, I've gotten my ones in place. I want to catch another Ash Greninja, because this one is a speed-lowering nature, which is terrible for it. <laughs> yeah, okay. But anyway, yeah, my team's pretty much in place, though, which I'm loving. Oh, we're getting there. We're getting there bit by bit. We might actually have a chance in this little draft tournament. It's just a shame this draft tournament isn't one of the official tournament -y things. Meaning I can't, act, I, I don't get anything for it. <laughs> I, like, uh, there's no, like, reward at the end of it. In the doubles tournament, what I discovered was, uh, the winners get... I'm not going to say the winners, but by the way, you can check the videos out for that stuff. But, um, or I think Captain Sparkle streamed it. That was the thing, too. Captain Sparkle was there. Never got to face him. Um, never got to face him. Other people faced him. I never got to face him. He was teamed with Mario. But, um, yeah. The people that get, like, an item reward, and he can become official gym leaders, which I thought was cool. So, if I, like, there's no reward for this one, though. So, even if I do somehow, by some miracle win the draft league i still get to become an official gym leader but it does ask the question if i was going to become an official gym what would i want to do because that i just discovered yeah that's an actual option that you can win eventually maybe because if you get like first second place you get stuff like that so i am thinking about that now i am kind of considering that as like a thing that i might want to do hmm it is i thought but right i think another thing i want to go do is i've been breeding these magnemites for bloody ages i think what i want to do is i want to go do some i want to try a different approach so i'm going to take you lot out of here for a second and you lot out of here i'm going to leave the two dittles breeding themselves because i just i want Dill two those breeds to give random eggs i want that <laughs> I want random Pokemon from them because they can give like Ultra Beasts as well, which would be cool. Uh, which, I mean, I don't think any Ultra Beasts I'm too bald with, but you know, I still, I still Ultra Beasts though, so I'd love to get them. But they can give you pretty much any Mon, so I just want to see that happen as much as possible. I need to get cakes for it though. Which, ooh, that was another thing. I need to go catch a milk tank. I discovered as well, if I put a milk tank out, I can just milk it internally, uh, eternally, so. Ooh, there's a thought. Alright, I mean, how do you make a cake again? Let me cakes and ages. I need cakes for, yeah, lots of details, but, but though. Right, cakes are made from, I know, eggs, sugar, which I've got tons of sugar fuel there. Wheat, I need to grow some wheat, and then three milk buckets. Okay, so if we get a milk tank, that'll be no problem. Um, okay, so we're going to put, actually, no, we're not going to do anything yet. I'm going to put more fences down. I'm going to put all the fences down and go from there. But yeah. Oh, things are falling into place. I still haven't got a house, like a proper house. I need to make a proper house. That needs to be a thing. I think I need to stream this at some point, like build a proper house and upgrade this place. Like maybe, maybe like change one of the areas over here. Maybe build my house over there. Like I'll clear up that area over there and build my, I build a bigger house over there of some kind. And then like fix more of these areas to have breeding grounds and stuff. And blah, 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 blah. All right, I want to make more changes to this place and make a little village out of it. What I really would like is if I could somehow convince others to come on <laughs> and get them to live in like a wee community with me. But I don't know, like, I don't know how easy it would be to get others on. I don't know how interested the likes of Pat and Mitch would be in playing here. I know Zaro wouldn't care. Inmo might? Like, both Inmo and Zaro made returns to videos recently, so, I mean... 
There's a chance they might care. They might fancy coming on. I don't know. It'd be cool to get all the guys on, though. Because, I mean, then there'd be people worse than Poke worse at Pokemon than me here. It'd be awesome. Right. Actually, I'm, I'm saying that. I don't even think I'm the worst at Pokemon here. Not, like, to bash anyone. I'm not saying anyone's, like, terrible. But I think, like... I actually watch some competitive stuff in there. It seems like some people don't really do any, like, have any relation to any competitive stuff whatsoever. What am I looking for again? Oh, yeah, I'm putting this away. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Put that in there. Thaw. And get fence posts. Boop. There we go. That's what I was after. Yeah. It seems like some people don't really bother with the competitive side of things. They're just, you know, casual catching Pokemon stuff, which is fair enough. You know, not, not everyone cares about competitive, but... I watch some of the more competitive stuff. I watch some of the more funny, interesting sets of stuff that can get made out of Pokemon things, so... Da, da, da. I feel like I've got at least some more knowledge than some folk. So I don't I don't feel I don't feel like I'm like the worst in the server when it comes to competitive battling. Like I, at least I've got a chance. Which I love. Alright, anyway. Da, da. That's what we're gonna have to do with this. And now we put alright, where where is it? Where's Timid? There's Timid there. So leave Timid alone. Put two Dittles on. I can't really can't really talk to them. These are madly in love, which is perfect. Exactly what I want. And I want ro lots and lots of random eggs. Preferably, grow me lots more date legs. The odds of that are like, insanely low, but give me lots more date legs. I'd love that. That'd be like really handy. It's not going to happen, but you know, it'd be nice if it did. Bah. All right, anyway. Let us move away from here now. Ba -ba -da. I can work on this more as time goes. But yeah. Ah, oh, I've been spending so much time in the server lately. I still I have a lot of fun on here. But I think... Oh, there's a Scarabug. Compound eyes as usual. Timid nature as usual. Now the fun part. We train it up and we see what happens. I say the fun part. It's just the part where I just hope and pray that it comes out with the actual thing I want for once. As it's refused to do so far. The ball. Actually, yeah, well, I, don't, I don't care about Eevees for it, so... But do Let's just battle some things and get some money while I'm at it. This is what I did, by the way, for EV training, before I had, like, the bands, I was obviously doing EVs, like, really slowly. So I was naturally, like, fighting tons of Pokemon, and every single time I was using Persian with, um, all, like, Happy... Ha I was going to say Happy Dance, that's not it. Happy Hour, and, uh, Thingy, Payday. I just did this combination over and over, because I just, like, throw out there. Like, I have a lot more stuff than before. Like, I have a lot of TMs. <laughs> now I've got, like, box, I've got box full of TMs now. And like not just not just I've not just like bought one of them some of the times. Like I've something I've bought several of them and things. So yeah, I'm loaded up in TMs. I've actually spent quite a bit of the money I acquired. Ooh! There's a thought. Now that I have lots of money, we can go to the supermarket and splurge out on all the nice things that I want. That I've been like holding off getting. That's now a thing. I mean I already owe like 70 grand to the tilted shop, but still, save for that. Okay. Wait, what are we what are we missing? Hold on. Currently right now. We've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We've got 12 of the 18 plates. So, I could go buy the other 6, and then we could plan to do Arceus this thing, because I've got two Master Balls. Oh, yeah, by the way, I've got two Master Balls. Um, ooh. That's a thought. I could also look for any Mega Stones that are around, plus Z Crystals that are around. I don't have, because currently, yeah, I've got 10, 11, 12, 13. We've got 14 of the 18 Z Crystals. I don't care about the Z Crystals as much. Ooh. Yeah, I think I'm going to go to the supermarket next. And I'm also going to train up this Scarabug really quick, because I just want to see what it evolves into. Oh. But yeah, I think... What I might do, though, is I might see if, like, people... If, if we're willing to have more people on the server, like, if that's a thing that's allowed. And if that's the case, ask if any of the others are interested in playing Pixelmon for a bit, because I, I don't know if they would be, but... It'd be fun to have them on. It'd be fun to have them on. It'd be fun if I could have, like, a little community thing over here. Because, I mean, realistically, if they come on, I mean, Mitch might want to do stuff himself, depending. But, he like, likes the pat and that. They're not going to want to do all this, like, all the, the many hours of grinding and stuff to get, like, half the things I have. So, like, I would just, I could just help them, realistically. Oh. It's a thought. It's also an idea to try and actually get us all back together a bit again. I don't know. Just a wee idea in my head at this point. We'll see how it goes. Alright, okay, um, I got two more levels. I need something that thing you can kill. Also up to, uh, yeah, 610,000 Pokey dollars. Oh. Down you go. Skadoosh. Oh, dark quite suddenly there. Oh yeah, I also heard apparently to get the oxes, you have to go into the inn for that. 
So we have to make a trip to the end at some point, which I think I know where one is. I think I know where an end portal is because I'm pretty sure uh, it's been marked in the Discord. So I think, yeah, we could probably, you know, make a trip there someday. I need to, like, leave all my stuff behind because I don't plan on losing anything in the end by accident. But, you know, I can, yeah, I can at least, I can jump over and try and get myself a bit of a deoxys. I need to bring Pokeballs now, though. Also, one more level. Could this be the one? Could this be the one that finally gives me the Vivillion that I want for just... I, I, I don't even... Uh, it's not even a good mod. It's not even a good mod. It's a terrible mod. I'm trying so hard to obtain the bloody thing. Like, I've spent more time trying to get this bug than anything else in this server right now. Just, I've, I've bred so many of them. I've released so many of them. It's terrible. It's been safe. You didn't get a level for that. I would have been annoyed. All right, you... Come on out, let's see what you become. Please be the thing. Please be the thing. <laughs> Please be the thing. All right. Here's our burgundy bug. Yeah, you're gonna learn all the things and stuff that I don't really care about because I'll get rid of them all later anyway. <sighs> As usual. Right. <laughs> oh, just go away. Just, just go. God damn it. So now on for the collection, I suppose. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. These 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 bugs are generally saddening me at this point. There's another one there actually. They're generally making me sad at this point. Like Ah, oh, I put so much time into them. It's horrible. Also, where's my leaf on? Oh there they are. I want to move all them over because like yeah, I want to do evolution stuff at some point as well. I want to get like all the evolutions like trained up so I can like try and make a team out of them. Even if it's just for like a, a funsy thing. But but though. There we go. Nice so. Let's see, that's my original token kiss and stuff. Yeah, I need to have a clear out my boxes soon as well. That's another thing I need to do. Right, well, there's my other egg. So, right, I think I'm going to do it. I'm going to quickly jump over to the, which am I call it? To the spawn town. We're going to have a wee look in the supermarket. Oh my god, it's Magnemite. Please have magnet pills so I can end this madness. <gasps> oh! Ah! Of course, it's the one with the wrong nature. Curse, it's the one with the wrong nature. Oh, Magnemite's horrible. Magnemite's horrible as well. I can't breed Magnemite with Magnemite, so I can't, like... I can't get the one I want easily, basically. I need to hope that the one... Oh, it's, 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 it's just a pain. All right, we'll just, just put it over there. Put it there. We'll, get, we'll get there eventually, probably. I mean, here, this is one I have with the right nature, just as the wrong thing. But I think, I know, I think I've got another plan for it as well. I think my new plan is going to be... I'm going to just try and, like... Catch a wild one with the thing I need. That's another mega blaze over there. Hello. What about Purge will do against this thing? Am I really gonna fight this with just two months? No. <laughs> no. I have a Purge that too. I reckon Talonflin could probably take him, but I'm not. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to really think about that one. I just want to, you know, where's where's Shuckle? There's Shuckle. Boop. With Shuckle on sides, we've got this. Okay, I'm away, people. There we go. Well, Snake's joined again. I can do the thing with them. Right, toxic. There we go. We've got speed boost, whatever. Use protect. Yeah, we took that. Uh, he took lots of damage. Power split. He died. We took more damage. I have two mons. I just realized that could be problematic. Fake out. Lol. You're gonna take lots of damage from the poison. Then I might as well just try and use. Pick. Yeah, you died. But Blaze can die too. Nice. Firium Z. Ooh, do I have that one? Oh, I wonder. Right, okay. Well, I'm going to quickly go do that. I'm going to go trade uh, Well Snipe back his stuff then, I suppose. Yeah, he's still got the same stuff. I'll, I'll try and see if he wants to trade back his stuff right now. And then I'll head over to Spawn Town. We'll go and buy lots of nice things since I'm a rich boy now. And I can afford all the nice things. All the little bits and pieces that I've, I've been wanting. Let's go grab them all. I do have a Fire MZ. Nice. That's great. It's, it's going to get harder and harder to get the new ones, isn't it? Bloody is as well. All right, pop all this away. Blah, blah, blah. Got our scatter bug. Oh, there's our Magnemite. We're all hatching together, beautiful. Star D with the right nature. So I gave my chance with these things. That's just egg hatching for you. That's just egg hatching for you. It's just how it works. Right, I uh, put. No, put you there. You're there. Doll. Give him that. Right, I'll, tra I'll train him up and see what comes up. Right, gonna go quickly and see what Well Snake's up to. Da, 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 da. And we are back. Also, license to sell justice. Okay, that's the thing. 
No hiring, see manager. Mr. Mames need not apply. Interesting. Right, okay, so I've given back the stuff to uh, Will's Knight, so he's he's got his bits. He's got the Warrior Z back, he's got his mons back. That's a thing off my checklist to do. Which is a quick over, like, an exchange thing anyway, so it was nothing too interesting. So, um, blah, 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 blah. Right, now that we're here, though, we can have a look at all the nice things that are here and potentially buy things, because we have lots of money now, which is just fabulous, and... I'm not sure if there's actually any of uh, the things here I actually want. Although, before I buy things from here, I potentially want to go look at the discount shop down the road. But I do know... I forgot to check the plates before I left. <laughs> ah! I forgot to check the plates before I left. That's annoying. I mean, I can get back easy now. Okay, I'm going to get the rest of the plates that I want uh, for RCs. So, RCs is like a thing we could potentially try next episode. We could finally do the RCs Cup. Because I've got most of them and I can just buy the last few. Because I, I need, like, what... Five or something? I forget the number now. Also, I haven't battled anything. Also, oh, my other egg hatched. It was Growlithe. It's it's jolly intimidate Growlithe. Nice. It's the the uh, Tease with it is. Hello, partner. You want to die, do you? Oh, the boss. I'll deal with that. Here we are. Oh yeah, the the polywags I get traded are gonna level up a bunch as well. Oh. Do I want to train a polywag? Not really. E. Right, okay. Discount store. Let's have a look. See. Yeah, so it's in the discount store. They were selling the red and blue orbs for 10 grand each, which apparently is insane because apparently it can take, like, hour, like a lot of hours, like, a good, like, 12-odd hours to get the orbs. Like, a pure grinding. Like, it's just completely focused on that task. See, so yeah, that's insane. Oh, also, I forgot I mentioned this. I actually currently have the dusk armor. That's the thing, too. Um, I just, I don't wear it because I like the look of... I like the look I have when I wear this armor list. I don't know. I just, I prefer this look... So that's the thing. Uh, you're just using shiny stones. You've just got all that stuff, which I could now afford. I could afford this stuff now if I really wanted, but I think that just gives EVs, doesn't it? Okay, what I'm going to do, I'm going to heal here. Then I can use Abra to get back here. I'm going to go back, I'll nip back home in a second and see what all our plates need and take a note of it. So that I know. But the but Before that though, can we see what nice things there are? Oh, Progly, hello, you need to die. You give, you give things, you give nice things. Blah, 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 blah. He's furious about it. He's going to die to a payday. Skadoosh. Give, give me a thingy knot. I think he's going to evolve. Eventually, when everyone's done leveling up. Jesus Christ. Forgot everyone was low leveled. You want to learn Ember? Kill. You want to learn Leer? No thanks. You want to learn Bubble? Jesus Christ. Sure. I got a... F Ow. Oh. Hope I got a, a Destiny knot thing for that. Oh, well. All right. You hurry up and evolve. My god, could you please be the one? Please be the one that finally just does the thing. <laughs> be the one of my dreams. God damn it. Oh, now nah, whatever. But, 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 but. Right, the discount store is just up here. I think this is, I don't know if this is the only other store. There's this store here, but that, that's coming soon. So it's not actually out yet. I'm wondering, is there more stores? Bill's Perfect Pokemon Shop, now opened. Welcome to, oh wait, hold on. Perfect Pokemon. Oh, it's Will's shop, actually, I just realized. Interesting. Interesting. Um, Does it say how much the prices are? Oh, yeah, you're still out. Oops. Sorry. Like, because there could be some good mons in here. Like, for instance, like, Starlax is there. I've not got a Snorlax. Starlax would be good. Tier 2. What are the tiers? Let's see how, let's see how this shot works. So, any Pokemon purchase from here does not come with... Uh, restriction, uh, redistribution rights. Uh, this means that you may use it for yourself to breed or battle, but you can't trade, sell its, uh, its babies to others. Okay, cool. Tier 1 is the lowest uh, of the three tiers. Higher tier because higher price. Perfect means at least 5 IVs with a value of 31 is correct. If there's something you want that isn't listed, say so. New inventory added regularly. You can pay via trades for other Pokemon items or Pokedolls. Message and just oh okay it's just offers then. <laughs> um, well, I mean, is there any good Pokemon here? Shells is good. Um, but the, but the, 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 the. let me see. If there's anyone I've not actually currently got that I would really like to get my hands on? Um, squirrels there. The Tweenies there. Uh, Farfetch is there. <laughs> if you really want it, Mawell is there. Beniri's there. Oh, Pinsir. There's a good one as well. I actually already have, like, a good magic card, so he's fine. Right, okay. That's, that, this is something to think about. I don't know how much, like, it would cost for this stuff. But, you know, I've got, got some money now. So, you know, potentially, potentially. 
could could manage it. Right, discount store, my new favourite place. So, uh, yeah, it cost is what three grand, five grand, twenty grand for all items in here. Nice. I already owe like quite a lot. I already owe like eighty grand in here. So I need to make sure I keep at least eighty grand uh, for things. Right, that's tier four. That's twenty grand for twenty grand for a trader. I'm gonna take that because that's a trader. That's handy. Um, evolutionary items. I already have most of those, but um. There are two, which is 5k. So I could still, I could take like an extra metal coat. Let's see, it says 25k so far. I already took all this stuff in the discount box. So that's whatever. Uh, bulk buy. Oh, I'm pretty sure also the no I use thing apparently is not a thing anymore. Apparently they've made it so now you can actually do it. I don't, I don't remember. But anyway, there's not really anything in there I want anymore. Um, but the, 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 the shirtless boxes I already have. Any items in here of any use? No, I don't think so. So whatever. Fossils! Fossils might be good. They only cost three grand and we can have like all the nice fossil things. So I will take an old amber. We'll take we'll take a take a take a take a take. Um take a dome and helix fossil just for the sake of having them. Uh, Archin! Oh take the plume fossil as well, definitely. Get our Archie boy back. Uh, Shield on, Craniodos, Anorith, The Leap, Amola, Tarunt. I don't really remember what those are. I think that's Gen 6 fossils, isn't it? Cool. All right, Pokeballs. There, it's three grand for eight. Which, uh, IOU limits 100k. Oh, crap. Crap. Oh, there's a limit. Oh, I have to put the trade machine back then. Okay, so my current set, I've got that's 12 grand plus that is five grand. I do believe like evolutionary items. Yeah, that's five grand Okay, so that's another 70. Oh, there's a limit. I didn't know that Oh, well, I own 87 grand now <laughs> Fine Glad I read that You know, it's excess probably fine. Cause I don't think there was any other things I really wanted anyway unless there's like Oh, no, there is Oh, no, there is hold on yeah, Megazons, Venus, right, Scissor, right, Sceptolite, this is right, would be useful. Um, I don't really care about the Z crystals right now. VIP slots, VIP slots. Summoning orbs, we already have those. Plates, they're 10 grand, that's the same as the other shop. Uh, special Z crystals, we've got the Muium Z, Hippurium Z, Solgalium Z, Linalium Z. Okay, so, I mean, other than the Muium Z. I don't know the other two there. Or do I have the Solgalio one? I don't remember. Oh. Well, whatever. We're on 97 grand to that shop now. Fair enough. <laughs> I'll pay it back someday. Right, what is this? Pokeball shop. The panda. Interesting. Welcome to the shop. Um. Price board. It doesn't sell on Poke Dollars, though. Or does it? Oh, no, it does. It does. It does. Okay, yeah, so one is 15k Poke Dollar. Wait, what? What? Great balls are two, so you're paying twenty k pokey dollars. There's none left. There's not. There's none left. There's there's luxury balls. So wait, we're paying twenty grand for sixteen. I mean, I suppose that means he gets a profit. It makes sense. Cause yeah, they are normally a grand each. There's nothing in here anyway. All right, never mind. <laughs> never mind. I thought I'd take a wee trip to the shop. I thought I'd take a wee trip to the shop since you're unloaded now and all that jazz. You know, okay, ninety seven of that money's like, has to disappear, but you know. Pretty much loaded at this point. Hmm. Any other shops while I'm here? Like, trash. The flower shop, I don't care about flowers right now, at the very least. I think I say, I think what I want to do now is I want to head back home, drop off the stuff I've got. I need to build a fossil machine, do that next time though. And yeah, then I need to go figure out where the last plates we are, that we need are. And I can like do that and Aye, then I guess next episode we can plan to go and face Arceus. Right, I'll just I'll make a quick cut and I'll go do the things I need to do. Okay, so I've taken a quick note of all the plates I currently have. And then go and compare that to the shop and see which ones I still need. Oh, so just to check while I'm here. Any cool things? Yeah, those Stone Age. Let's grab some of those since we're here. Boop. Let's grab... Pokeballs, what you got? Uh... I swear you had Ultra Balls once upon a time. I swear you did. Right, Abra, do me a favour, bud. Take me back to the place, would ya? Skadoosh. Nice job, Abra. 
Right, uh, the supermarket. Let's just go see what we can get. Cause I assume, I think all the plates are in there, so I can definitely get all of them while I'm here. Also, I'm not going the right way. Hold on. Oh, that's the way. Yeah, there we go. I always get mixed up in which path I'm meant to take around here. Right, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're gonna, we know the right way. So after this, I'll have all the plates. I know where the Arceus thing is, which means, yeah, next episode we can go probably do the Arceus thing. Although, a question then becomes, do I try and catch Arceus in the Master Ball or not? Also, wait, while well, I'm here, where are the Pokeballs? Where are the Pokeballs? I swear there's a chest of Pokeballs in it. I forget where, but I swear there's a chest of Pokeballs in it, or there at least there was. No, I must, I must be mistaken in that one. That was a chest of Pokeballs in it. I could just change my Rotom here. I could just come here and change my rotom. All the things are here already. Interesting. I guess there's not Pokeballs here unless is it over in one of these side bits? No, I don't see it. Oh. I thought there was. Interesting. Right, anyway, uh plates. Okay, so currently there are ten grand each. So I've got dragon, I have got fire, I've got fighting, I've got mind, I've got pixie, I've got dread, I don't have the splash plate, so that's one. I don't have the sky plate. I don't have the icicle plate. I've got the medal and the bug. I've not got the zap plate. I don't have the toxic plate. I've got this. Wait. Oh, and I've got dread. I don't have spooky. So yeah, I've not got the spooky plate. I've got the iron. I've got the zap. I've got the okay, so it's one, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, the six long of my 13 means I should now have all 19, I believe. That's a trainer. I need to kill something real quick. I want to, I want to, I want to think of this speed on really fast. Hold on. Do, do, do. That, have I now got them all? That's it. There's a, there's a thingy bug there. It doesn't even matter, though. It's not the bug itself I need. It's the bloody, it's the evolution. Oh. So, yeah, I had 12 then. I had 12 plates. Or, there's a 19 types. No, there's 18 types, isn't there? Or is it 19? No, I think it's 18. I think I don't remember how many Pokemon types there are because I generally forget after all this time. Interesting. What we got? Shield does. <laughs> Right, you, back in the thing. We're gonna head back really quick and just make sure I've got all the plates and then we can, yeah, make our plan for next time. Do 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 do, and we're back, and please have ultra balls. God damn it. Alright, yeah, you're right, fine. Give me some Pokeballs at the very, oh my god, no, 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 let's not, let's not go crazy here, let's not go crazy. Let's take, yeah, give me, give me like, give me a stack of Pokeballs, just so I've got them, just in case I need them, eh? There we go. Right, oh yeah, I also need to teleport back really quick to the supermarket and, like, mark up that I actually, like, took 60 grand worth of products because, you know, I, did, I didn't mark it and I owe you before I went out. But it's fine, I'll do that in a second because I can go back with the teleport thing anyway. But okay, so, in total, let's take the four fossils out. Yeah, it's 17 typings, yeah. Duh. For that, that's all of them. We've got a lot, I think. That's all the plates I need for Arceus. So... Next episode, we're going to go and see Arceus, I guess, because, oh yeah, I forgot to put those away. Because, uh, yeah, it's, it's right there, the other options there. I've got a Master Ball if I need it. I've got means to try and catch him normally. Um, I mean, I can try and get some more Pokeballs before then as well. Like, I, I don't know which balls particularly would be the best for him, but, yeah, okay, I'll get some more Pokeballs before then just in case. But, yeah, I'll try and catch him normally, but I can definitely use the Master Ball in worst case, but... Yeah, I think next time we're gonna do the Arceus thing and just see how that goes. Cause I'm, I mean, I want to try that thing. I've, I've seen, I've known where the thing is ready, so I'm tempted to see where it is. Also, the day, how close along are you to like breeding and stuff? Well, there's no hearts on you yet. So that's that's a shame. But then again, it's not been that long yet. That's something to work on. But right. Anyway, then, people, thank you all very much for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed these shells. I got to splash a bit more money about that. I've got lots of money. I'm gonna get more as time goes anyway. Cause every time I battle, I literally use Persian and like get lots of money and I'm loving it. Oh, my money problems are gone. It's great. Got lots of legendaries now to play with, which is awesome. And yeah, yeah I'm just in a quite good place. I've got Dittles now so I can breed easier. It's, yeah, stuff's coming together. We're getting ourselves there. We're getting more competitive mons. We're getting like fancier mons that we like and yeah, quite enjoying this. But right, anyway then people, thank you all for watching that. I'll see you all next time for more Pixelmon. Let's go. Go. Bye everybody.